So mechanical tension, you have two types of mechanical tension. You have passive mechanical tension, which happens on eccentric phases of uh, dynamic repetitions when you lower the weight. Mm -hmm. So you get passive tension. The magnitude of passive tension that you're going to get there is depending on a multitude of variables. Um, you have active mechanical tension, which happens on the concentric when you have the cross bridging that's going on between actin and myosin, and basically there, you know, you have the that action going on, um, kind of at that very tiny uh, that level within in in the muscle cell. So you have those two different types of mechanical tension. When we talk about mechanical tension within the growing muscle realm, what we're really talking about for the most part are kind of two factors we're talking about. Well, before that, if we're, if we're talking about the aromatization, the, the phase between, I can never say that word, the amortization phase, mm -hmm. the, what happens between the eccentric and the concentric, Yeah. right? How does that play into that? And we're not stretch position wise, just from that repetition wise. And, and what granularity do you mean? Um, from the stamp, well, if we're talking a plyometric, right? Okay. So, I mean, that would be the easiest way to explain it. Okay. You, know, you, you have that stop, right? Yes. Then there's that stretch reflex. I You're guess, talking about like the stretch shortening cycle. Uh, yes, yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So, yeah, I mean, that's, so if we're, we're lowering a weight like that, um, the passive tension comes yes. from, okay. If we're lowering our weight, passive tension is usually coming from a couple of places. Um, passive tension will be coming from Titan which is a, a very large protein molecule that runs um, through the sarcomere. And we also have the slow detachment rates that are happening between actin and myosin. So you have that combination of those things kind of occurring. You do get some passive tension that occurs um, from the sarcolemma and, and some other stuff kind of uh, in that, you know, basically surrounding the, the fiber in the cell. But for the most part, what we're looking at when we talk about passive tension is from Titan, 